It's graduation 2021 and uh, I'm here with Kate who's graduated this year uh, with our BSc in acupuncture. Um, Kate, many congratulations and uh, it's so lovely to see you here on this very blustery day. Very blustery, <laughs> wet, windy. <Yes. laughs> That's fine and obviously you know one, one of the reasons that I wanted to speak to you really is because you know you, you've finished this year so that would have been September am I correct? Yes well yes yes. Yes. Yeah. It is, although I sort of did a, a slightly different path, so I actually managed to get signed off in May. Did you really? How amazing. Yeah. Many congratulations yeah. for that. So so you've actually been in practice for... Yeah, about four months now. Brilliant. Yes. Tell us about being in practice, because obviously, you know, if people are watching this video, they're going to be thinking about studying acupuncture yes. with us. And yeah. the most important thing for them is, are they going to be able to get patients, yeah. earn money, you know, fulfil their dream of kind of like, you know, being self-employed and working as an acupuncturist. So tell us a little bit about what your journey's been like. Okay, so I can say yes to all those, all the above of the questions, which was, can you get a job, can you earn money, and can you sort of follow your passion? So yes, you absolutely can. Um, so coming towards the end of my third year, I was able to do my last clinic days actually out in practice, which was a really amazing opportunity to be able to do. And as a result, I became an associate in a practice um, in Leeds. So um, it was sort of a really nice transition from being having the support of my supervisor in the clinic and my um, uh, tutors at uni to then being supported going into practice. And then because my the person I was going to work for knew that I was on this route, so I was still a student, I got a lot of support there. And so built up my caseload from a few people a day to now sort of seeing five, six people a day. Um, and it's just you know it's a, a perfect way to transition from being a student and go into practice and it's 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 a fabulous job uh, it's a really challenging job and every day is different and um no no day is the same actually and you you know there are there are always going to be moments where you sort of have a uh, take stock of where you where you're at but it's fabulous and I couldn't really imagine a, doing a, a retraining how I've done. So coming from an NHS background and knowing that I wanted to stay within healthcare, but then being able to work for myself and being able to just choose my hours, choose my workload, choose about how I wanted to go about doing things and choose my specialisms and everything like that. Um, it really just feels really empowering um, and really exciting for the future because the people that are coming to see us now, so obviously after the, the pandemic, we've got a lot of long COVID cases. So being really current in what we're treating as well as obviously you know, using our traditional TCM with, you know, the complaints that you will see in clinic and the university, so lots of MSK and all those sorts of things. So, yeah, it's it's a, it's an interesting career that I think is going to keep me um, challenged for the rest of my working days, probably. Oh, that's fantastic. And I've just seen you, obviously, you know, you've seen a few people that you obviously haven't seen for a while. Um, you know, tell us about your cohort. How's it like being part of a cohort? Well, yeah, it's very special at the NCA because we are, you know, you know, it's, it is a small, smaller university environment, um, and I've made friends for life. Really, people that even now, so I've gone into practice and you know, WhatsApping friends, you know, asking for if people have got any information on or where they direct me for different things. We're doing that reciprocally. Reciprocally, I can't say that word today, <laughs> but yes, uh, and just having. Um, I just feel like as I go forward I've got people that I can turn to at every point uh, and that's been the same way all through the course um, the tutors have always sort of been there as our a reference point you know but all the way through we've had you know especially during Covid when we didn't see each other which was a real big difference for our cohort really um, we've managed to sort of stick together and just feel like we've got a really lovely support network that's going to last us through our acupuncture days really. That's absolutely wonderful look Kate congratulations Thank you. it's really lovely to see you here again so just go and have a lovely uh, time and celebrate with your buddies. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.